what I'm going to show here is how I've trained this young pup, Snow, in only a couple of, or less than a, in a week, to come down with me, but realise the gate down here is a barrier. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk him down here, and you'll see, he'll only come so far, and he'll realise that the barrier is in front. As I walk through, he'll walk back up and play with the other dogs, because this is his area. He's got all of this to run around with. So let's go and see what we can do with Snow. Right, Snow. Now this is our wee pup, we just sort of play with him a wee bit, give him a wee bit of time. You've got to spend a lot of time with a pup, just on and off all day long. You don't have to be there for 10 minutes, quarter of an hour, just as long as you come up. Give the pup a pat so it knows when it comes up to you, you're friendly and it just wants to come up and play. Now I'm going to walk down to the gate and as I walk through the gate, that dog will stop before the gate and come back up here to these other dogs. This is a less than a week's training. As we can see with that training, that was about our body language. I never told that dog to stay, I never done things with that dog, that young pup. He realised that I was coming down here, away from the other dogs. We've got dogs under the tree up here in the shade sitting around. He realises that he just goes back and plays with them. So when I'm through the fence, that's the boundary. It's not just a physical boundary, it's a psychological boundary. If the dog understands he's not allowed through under the fence, then leave him down there. I had one client in one day, told me I should heighten up underneath here so that the dogs couldn't get through. But if they couldn't get through, how do they come through when I want them? That means I've got to come over here and open the gate. Now I don't want to have to come over and open the gate. I want to whistle the dogs. They'll either come underneath or jump over top when I call them. But if I don't want them, I want them to stay down the back all the time.